Hey tennis fans, I'm Blair Henley here at the U.S. Men's Clay Courts in Houston, Texas with a fan favorite, former world number seven, Fernando Verdasco. Fernando, thanks so much for taking some time. I appreciate it. Well, let's start with last year. At the end of the year, I guess, a neck injury, right? And that's this, kind of... This year? This year. Yeah. And that's kind of a more unusual injury, I guess, for a tennis player. Do you know what the problem was? Well, I don't know it from when it came. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I, just, I just, you know, woke up yeah, one day so pretty sore and yeah. it went more and more. So after a week, um, you know, it's pretty rare. Normally, right. I thought that it was maybe like sleeping in a bad position yeah. or whatever. So after a week with pain, I... I I decided to make an MRI and, mm -hmm. and they told me that I had two bulging discs in, wow. in, in my neck. So, um, you know, it was not pretty good news. Yeah. They told me that it could take pretty long, almost like two months to be 100%. So, you know, I couldn't play Memphis, Acapulco, right. and I, I, I lost the whole month of February and, and March. It was like hard for me yeah. too, but um, yeah. But you're feeling good now? Yeah, my neck is... is uh, is feeling good. Sometimes, you know, if if I'm like um, with my neck like in certain position for a long, like for a period of time, mm -hmm. maybe like 15 minutes or so, yeah. it's a little sore. But uh, like for a normal life or playing, it's, it's feeling good. Yeah. You've had, like you mentioned, the first few months have been tough. There have maybe been some losses that haven't been a whole lot of fun. Is there something after a tough loss that you do, maybe extra chest press, a nice dinner that you know makes you feel better? <laughs> no, really. I mean, when, um, when you really mm, have a, a tough loss, um, yeah. you don't really want to do or, <laughs> or you don't really feel like doing anything. No? Yeah. You, just, you just think about that. You try to don't think about it, but you you cannot really don't right. think about it and uh, it takes maybe like a couple of days to yeah. to recover and yeah. and then start practicing again yeah. and you 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 know you really realize that is the only way you know to to get out of um or of a bad uh period or you know or, or a bad uh, moment playing bad just working more and and keep trying you know yeah. So we talked about it's your first time in Houston. Have you heard any crazy Texas accents yet? No, <laughs> not really. Uh, I mean, I was like all the time with the with the players, or yeah. or you know, uh, I didn't really speak with too many people from here, yeah. or or they didn't tell me at least the, <laughs> that yeah. that words, but. Uh, like I said yesterday, you know, maybe I, I learned some before I leave. <laughs> Perfect. You were live tweeting from the finals in Miami, or you may, I don't know, I guess you weren't there, but you were kind of tweeting the mm -hmm. finals. I was, yeah. Is there a future in broadcasting maybe, or in media for well, you? Well, if they pay me well. <laughs> You mentioned that uh, I, I saw some interview where you said if you know if you were to quit tennis tomorrow, you would maybe give acting a try. Yeah, I would. What? Like, it's, it's something that that I would I would like to try after tennis and uh, you know I know it's a it's a tough job and um, yeah. it's not a, it doesn't look as good as after watching the movie right, you know, right, right. But, uh, but it's uh, it's something that that I that I enjoyed watching uh, some friends and, and some other people that I know doing it mm -hmm. and I think I would like to do it. Yeah. Well, what were we thinking? Like action movies? Well. Um, <laughs> Terminator Maybe. style. Yeah, that would be good. I mean, I don't know. You know, uh, you you can you can really know about it. I think, like when it comes in one day, if one day comes, then uh, then you you I will just try my best uh, whatever I do. But of course, I prefer action than <laughs> terror or something like that. No comedy, yeah. also maybe yeah. good like romantic yeah. comedy. Uh, perfect. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm now, if uh, if there was a movie made tomorrow about your life, who would you want to play you um, in the movie? I don't know. Like who? who yeah, which what actor? actor? Yeah. I don't know. There are too many stuff. Um, <laughs> like good actors, of course. You yeah. Know, and, and 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 I would choose one. Like you about just line my, them up about about and then yeah, evaluate them. about my about <laughs> my age. I mean, like 
uh, I like I like many actors like Will Smith. It doesn't look like me so much, but he's a good actor. <laughs> uh, and uh, you know, Christian Bale is a good yeah. actor too. Yeah. And uh, uh, Dolby Junior is a great actor, but a, bit, a little bit older than me. And uh, Johnny Depp. So I mean, there are too many, but Johnny Depp. Oh, 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 a little the older. hair, at least. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you know, I need to look for a I don't know a Latino one and. Uh, I don't really know right now. Uh, Mauri Nolasco, a friend of mine from for, from Puerto Rico, that he he was working in Prison Break, and he just did a small role in um, in um, How to Die Hard, nice. in the last movie, yeah, at yeah. the beginning of the movie. He's a great friend, and, and he's Latino, and he's okay, a little bit so older, we, we but just a few years, so then. maybe you he can do it. And he likes tennis, <laughs> so yeah. Great. Well. Uh, you obviously spend a lot of time on your fitness, but I'm wondering, is there one exercise, one footwork drill that you love? Is there something that, even though it's obviously hard work, is there something that you Yeah, but favorite? I mean, uh, like it's hard, but at the end you, you need to try to enjoy making a hard um, practice, no? Uh, yeah. A hard workout. Uh, so, I mean, I, I like to work on the gym. Yeah. Uh, I like to uh, do like, bicycle or yeah. running or swimming sometimes yeah. when I'm in Madrid and I have more time uh, but also I like to do like drills on the court and yeah. and, 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 and practice the mobility on court that is is really you know the the important thing at the end yeah, yeah. like how, how you move on the court at the end you are not in a bicycle on the court or, or swimming no? <laughs> but I mean uh, it's, it's or, or lifting weights you need yeah. to work hard in all that but uh, like strength, aerobic and everything, but then at the end you need to translate that yeah. to the court and, and the drills on the court is, is pretty important. Is there one that you hate when your trainer says do this? I mean, yeah, uh, when you are doing drills on the court and, and, and the trainer doesn't, doesn't put the ball inside the court, sometimes I need to say that I get pissed because they just <laughs> need to put the ball inside the court with the hand and they can't, so I'm like, come on, I, I get a little bit, but you know, at the end, it's, uh, a, it it's a workout end, that you need to run and just yeah. try to to do your best. Okay. Well, last night when I was watching you play, great win, singles, yeah. I was admiring your bun. Yours is much nicer than mine. And so my I'm going to go here, cut it now. <laughs> so here is my question. How do you keep it so perfect when you have your hat on? If, if there's no hairs well, flying some, anywhere? Sometimes, yes. I mean, yesterday... After a set and a half or so, I, I needed to take it off and made it again because you know it's so long already that when it goes out of the of the van, it's just like so long and it bothers me. So I was gonna go right now after this to cut it a little bit and. Oh and really? Yeah. Do you have a traveling hairstylist? No, no, no. I mean, I'm not. I'm not that that fashion and glamorous. But um, you know, I'm gonna just go to to any hair salon around here and and just tell them to cut my ponytail a little bit. <laughs> see, see. <laughs> if not, I just chop it off, it's fine. <laughs> okay, well, I've been, just on your Twitter page, I've seen a lot of pictures of your dog, Slayer. Yeah. Do you, does he get to travel with you? Sometimes, yeah. I mean, yeah. Um, he's, you know, he, he's in New York most of the time okay. with, uh, with my girlfriend, but, uh, but now when I go back to Europe, um, I go to Monte Carlo, Barcelona, and he's not going to be there. But then after I play in Madrid, so the week before Madrid and Madrid, he's going to be there. You must miss him then. I, he I, do, like I do, but I also, I also have uh, three more dogs uh, oh, in okay. Madrid that oh. I, I even miss dog more because uh, I didn't come back to Madrid in the last five months. And that one, they don't travel. Slayer is the one that travels and know how to travel. And, and know how he's to, a pro. Uh, yeah, he's, he, he knows how to travel. And, don't bother. Um, the other one uh, are way too crazy, so I cannot take them with me. But Slayer has like a wardrobe. Like he has clothes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's like a, he's like a little baby. How big is his closet? Yeah, he's like a little baby. <laughs> uh, another trend I see on your uh, Twitter page, shirtless photos of yourself. Yeah. So my question is, on average, what's like the retweet rate? Of one of those pictures. I, I mean, I, I don't know. I, I really don't look. You to don't. The you retweets. don't track it. No, I, I really don't look to the retweets. I just try to put a little bit of everything. Yeah. You know. Yeah. I know that there. You are, do accomplish that. You have a, I mean, I try to put pictures of where I am. I try to put pictures of what I'm doing, and try to put pictures of myself now, of myself like um, back in the years, like when I don't know. 
like you know 2010 or yeah, nine or even before i mean just try to to yeah. have a little bit of better yeah if you could borrow one shot from another player on tour what do you think it would be from who Oof, well, uh that's a tough question uh, i would say maybe it's tough because I mean, if I if I ask for the surf of Isner or Karlovic, they are like six foot ten, <laughs> and I don't have that. So, so if you can have I mean, that and still be you yeah, know, that would that would be pretty good. Like if I nice. if, yeah, if I would ha if I would be able to have the surf of Isner or Karlovic, I think my game would be much easier. <laughs> Number one in the world. Mm, yeah, I don't know, know, but <laughs> I will have more chances for sure. Uh, what has been your most bizarre, strange fan encounter? Have you had any bizarre ones? Strange ones in public, mm. where people are. I mean, I, there is strange people everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> I need to say, but um, and I, I, I try to, to you know, to be the same with everybody. And yeah. even if sometimes there is weird people that come up, comes over and say weird things. I just try to just ignore it. <laughs> so like put a good just face and like say like thank you, thank you so it. much. And, and and after I think like how how they can say that. But yeah. I mean, these people for everything. Yeah, you've been on the tour for over ten years now. So if you could go back to when you were saying nineteen, ten years ago, and give yourself advice, what do you think it would be? Well, I mean, um, of course, I'll, I will do something different. Some things not. Um, but you know, I think everything is 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 in that. I mean, is for that moment. No, like uh, when I was younger, I I didn't really care about things that now I care. I was like more like you know crazy in the way that you know doing. Okay, I do this. I just do it and don't really think about it. So with the years, you you know more about everything and what is good for you, what is bad. Like you know, so it's experience. But um, of course, you know. Uh, I will, I will, I will take care. Like maybe more of myself. Not meaning like I didn't take care. I, right. I think I, I really did. But maybe more or be like doing sometimes some kinds of exercise that maybe I didn't do it now that I learned with the years. Right. So of course all all that, all that experience that I I didn't have, uh, in that moment, and use it. No, but uh, but in general, I think that you know what I did. Like I'm not, I, I don't regret anything of what I did. I just, I just think that I could maybe add some right. other things that now I know for yeah. in that time. All right. Well, that's it from us. But and we can't pay you lots of money for this. But can you sign us out? We'll see you next time oh, here on okay. Tennis Now. Yes. All right. Go for it. We'll see you next time here on Tennis Now. <laughs> we'll see you next time here on Tennis Now. Perfect. <laughs>